Hi Virgos, this is Keep It Real with your reading again. I made a mistake and erased your reading. Okay, Virgos, I made a mistake, deleted your reading. <laughs> That's what I mean to say. Okay, Virgos, I hope all is well with you guys. I hope you're staying positive, protected, blessed, and prayed up and keep you guys all the way up. This is going to be another reading for you guys because I made a mistake, deleted your reading, okay, that I had already posted for you guys. I know y'all saw it already. I know y'all listened to it already. But now I got to do it again, okay? So this is going to be a reading for you guys from November the 4th to November the 6th, 2021, Virgos. Virgo, spirit guides, and guiding angels, earth angels, ancestors, God, angel, Holy Spirit. What are the messages for the Virgo? Virgo, Virgo, what is going on in the Virgo's life? Spirit guides, what do the Virgos need to know? What are the messages for the Virgo? Virgos, Virgos. Ooh, Virgos, you got the sun and you got the ace of wands. Ooh, Virgos, good things are happening, honey. Okay. The sun, yes. Happiness, marriage, bright prospects, yes. Ace of Wands, new beginnings, okay. New ideas, new creation, Virgos. I love it. Beautiful, okay. Okay, we got the Nine of Cups as well. I don't know if you're dealing with a, a Pisces or this can be you. Money is improving, more money on the way. You feeling smudge, you feeling happy, you feeling peaceful, all right. Six of Swords, this could be Aquarius coming towards you, Virgo, or this is you traveling to see a, a Aquarius, or you just traveling to get away, you know, moving to calmer water, okay, okay, also, Knight of Pentacles, this is you, Virgo, you're going to see Aquarius, this is the star card, you're going to pay Aquarius a visit, okay, all right, now, you're going to get up with Aquarius, you're going to make some type of business some type of offer with aquarius okay this could be an ex of yours or someone that you know you traveling at night to uh offer aquarius some type of um offer money business it could be sex okay <laughs> you see this aquarius as a star okay you think this Aquarius is beautiful? All right. So you're going to make a deal with the Aquarius. So yeah, this is Aquarius. Uh -huh. Are you moving towards Aquarius or um, Aquarius moving toward you? Okay. All right, let's finish some cards. Spirit guides, my God, angels, or angels, ancestors, my God, angel, Holy Spirit. Give me more messages for Virgos. Virgos, my lovely Virgos. Spirit guys, my God, angels or angels and sisters, my God, I angel, Holy Spirit. What are the messages for Virgo? Give me more messages for Virgo from November 4th to November 6th, 2021. Virgo, what is going on in the Virgo? Spirit guys, my God, angel or angel and sisters. Give me more messages for the Virgos. More messages for the Virgos. Okay, Virgos, I'm going to cut, guys. Okay. Virgo, you got a good reading. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to cut this. No, I'm not going to cut this. We got the page of pentacles. So, so this is you waiting on a check, Virgo. You waiting on some motherfucking money, honey. Okay, you looking out. You checking your bank account or whatsoever. All right? You waiting on this money, honey. Mm-hmm. Or you going to cash a check? You going for a loan? Yeah, go for a loan. You need a loan or whatsoever. Go for it. Okay, money looks good. Like I said, you waiting on money, you waiting on check, you checking your bank account whatsoever. You checking your phone, you 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 checking your text messages. Okay. The Empress. This can be you, Virgo. You can be the Empress. You done been through some shit and back. And you done healed. And you're a very loving, caring, hard person. This is not for all Virgos, okay? But this can be someone that you know, a Taurus, but this can be a family member, friend, who was forever auntie, someone that you know that's very loving, caring, and nurturing, understanding she or he loves unconditionally, okay? This can be someone you looking at, Virgo, or this can be you. You can be the empress, okay? 
You done been through some shit. You can teach other motherfuckers what you've been through. Okay. And when you, you know, you got out of it, you can, you know, you're an empress, you know. You manifest it. You're a manifester. You can be a teacher, a counselor, a mother figure, or who whatsoever, but you love me. You're caring. You're nurturing. You're here to help others. They can't help themselves. Okay? And you're very understanding, Virgo. Not This is not for all Virgos, okay? All Virgos is not, okay? But, uh, yeah, this could be someone that you know as well, Virgo, that you look up to. That you looking at, you watching, okay? You like this person. You know this person is very loving, caring, nurturing. This can be your mother, Virgo. Okay, or well, this can be you, all right? The star card, this is Aquarius. Are you dealing with Aquarius, Virgo? Okay, or well, you can have Aquarius in your chart. You can be feeling rejuvenated. You can be feeling, like, strong and powerful. You can be feeling beautiful, okay? All right? Um, you're a manifester. You you know you you can be a star seed as well, Virgo. Or you know Aquarius that you see is beautiful and you know someone that you I don't know you used to date or just someone that you have a crush on or whatsoever or someone that you see as a star as a celebrity or who whatsoever. But this can be you, Virgo. You feeling like a star? You on top of your shit? You feeling good? You feeling yourself? You feeling strong and powerful, okay? You feeling very confident. You feeling content. You know what I'm saying? You, you just in. You doing your thing, okay? You manifesting. You having your business, okay? We got the six of swords. You got a lot of Aquarius, Virgo. So you got to be dealing with Aquarius, or you can have Aquarius in your chart, but you're dealing with Aquarius because it's Aquarius. I don't know if you're moving towards Aquarius. Or you moving away from Aquarius, you're moving to calmer water, or this could be Aquarius that's moving toward you, Virgo. Okay. But someone's moving. You can be moving to a new home, new resident, out of town, out of state, or whatsoever. Or you could be moving, you could be, like I said, you could be traveling to go see someone. Okay, Virgo. But you got a lot of Aquarius in your chart, so you got to be messing around with Aquarius or something like that. You got the Nine of Cups. This is a Pisces. This can be you, Virgo. You feeling good. You feeling pleased. You feeling smudged. Look at Spirit talking to me. Spirit say good news on the way, Virgo. Money looks good. More money on the way. You feeling pleased. Oh, Spirit is talking. Yeah, Virgos. You feeling pleased. You feeling smudged. You feeling satisfied. You know, you're feeling good. I love it. You're feeling good. Or well, this can be a Pisces that likes you as well, Virgo. Someone that's very attracted to you. Okay. They got very high sexual desires for you as well, Virgo. Someone's like they got a, like a crush on you. You know, they like they undress you with their eyes or whatsoever. They're very attracted to you. they horny for you. they thriving for you, Virgo. <laughs> but someone likes you, Virgo. Like I said, this can be a Pisces, okay? Or this could just be you feeling good. You feeling pleased and smudged. This could be someone that, that I don't know, you had sex with, Virgo, or an ex or someone. But someone likes you. They're attracted to you, okay? They like how you make the... <laughs> They like how you make they make them feel. Duh, why I can't talk? What's up with that? But they like the way you make them feel. They 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 just feel pleased. You make them feel good. You make them feel satisfied, Virgo. Okay. Oh, this is you. Okay. Let me get off of this. Ooh, look at this. What did I tell you, Virgo? Did I tell you more money on the way? Ace of Pentacles. God damn it, Virgo. You like I said, you feeling good, baby. You feeling your motherfucking self. Money on the way, give surprises. Your wish has been granted. The divine wish has been granted. Your wishes, prayers has been heard by the universe, by God, by your God and angels, your earth angels, your ancestors, your spirit. Guys, God damn it. Motherfucker. Motherfucker, motherfucker. I love it. I love it. I love it. I see marriage. Uh, someone's offering you a job. More money coming in. It can be marriage, someone's buying a ring, someone wants to propose to you, or you're going to propose to someone. Beautiful. I, oh, I love it. Oh, three of cups, Virgo. God damn it. Oh, celebrations. My God, I love it. 
celebration, threesome, third party, family reunion, reunited with someone, ex, a new love, a new relationship, hot sex, hot passion and sex, drinks and smokes. Baby, welcome to the party, god damn it. Ooh, yeah, you want to party with Barbie? Ooh, I love this reading, Virgo. God damn it, motherfucker. You celebrating, baby. You feeling good. You feeling yourself. I love it. New love, new relationship, family, you know who, whatsoever. You doing it. You feeling it. You Man, I love it. I love it. Night of one. So this is going to be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius that's coming toward you, Virgo. They see you feeling yourself. They see you feeling good. And honey, they want to come in and join you, baby. They want to join a threesome, Virgo. <laughs> I don't know if you go both ways, you bisexual, or are you whatever you are, it don't make a difference. Hey, I don't knock nobody, I don't judge nobody, as long as you're not doing anything wrong to anyone or anybody, okay? But you're doing good, you're feeling yourself, you're celebrating, you're smiling, god damn it, you're rejoicing, you're singing, you're partying, you're turning this shit up, okay? You got a night of ones, it's a fight time, someone wants to come in and join the party, they want to join the threesome. Okay, <laughs> or this could be the police coming in to break up the goddamn party, or this is an important letter. So this can be important news, important letter. This could be an ex or someone that likes you. They wants to come back to you. They wants to, um, they want to explain to you what happened. Okay, they love you. They miss you. They want your back. Now that you're happy, you're doing good. You're doing well. A motherfucker wants your back. Really? Oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? Okay, we got the King of Cups. This is be a Scorpio. Or this, yeah, this is Scorpio. Someone's very frustrated at you, uh, Virgo. Someone's feeling very upset, emotional towards you. I don't know if you broke up with this person. This could be a family member, friend, who was so evident. This could be a friend of me, an enemy. This is someone's mad, Virgo. They mad because you got new beginnings. You got ace of ones, goddammit. They mad. New beginnings. New ideas and new creation. This person mad at you, Virgo, because you feeling yourself. You feeling good. You moving on, baby. You moving on, Virgo. This Scorpio, whoever this Scorpio is, so this could be an any sign. This person I'm mad because you got new beginnings. You moving on. You moving on. You on your motherfucking throne, goddammit, like a pot of neck bones. You moving on. So whoever this King of Cups is. They fucking mad. They very emotional towards you. They frustrated. This can be an ex, a lover, a family member, a friend, an enemy, a friend of me, who whatsoever. They mad because you on your motherfucking throne. Okay? They mad because you on your throne, baby. Okay? How did I have this card with it like this? Yes. Okay? Check this out. We got the Eight of Cups. You got a Pisces that's coming towards you, Virgo? Okay? Let me, I think I switched it. Let me see. How did I have these cards? Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm going to do it like, yeah. You got the four of cups because I had messed the cards. I had made a mistake. Okay, four of cups. So you got a cancer, Virgo, that's disappointed of you. They mad as hell because you're moving on to new beginnings, goddammit. Okay, a new start off. This goddamn cancer dog, I don't know. They thought you, they thought. They was going to get you back. They thought, you know, that y'all was going to work out something together. This could be an ex or someone, someone you haven't seen in a while whatsoever, or a, a who, okay, a family member, but something, they, you know, something didn't go in their favor. They thought, I don't know, they thought you was going to be waiting on them forever. I don't know, this person thought you was going to, um, I don't know, this person tried to take something from you. Yeah, this person thought... Y'all was going to work things out, but they waited too late. And shit didn't go in their favor, so they mad and disappointed. Because you're not working, you know, with them anymore. You're not working on a relationship with them anymore. You're moving on. Okay? We got the four uh, cups. Okay, this is, eight, I mean, the eight of cups. Okay, this could be a Pisces that's coming toward you, Virgo. This can be an ex, a family member, a friend, whosoever. Okay, this would be someone that backstabbed you, betrayed you, ghosted you, neglected you, abandoned you. Now they're coming back to you, for you, because they're receiving a motherfucking karma. They are going through karma, okay? This person keeping secrets and lies. We got the moon up here. So hidden agendas and motives and flaws and all. This person coming with a lot of baggage. 
Okay, Virgo, this person is coming in with a lot of baggage, a lot of bullshit, okay? Like I said, Virgo, page of pentacles. You waiting no money, you checking your bank account, you, you checking your phone, what you take, you know, you looking at your phone, you reading your text messages, okay? You waiting on a check. Money looks good. Yes, now the cups, money is improving more money on the motherfucking way, Virgos. I told you, you got a king of cups, you got a goddamn Scorpio. It's going to be any sign that's very emotional because things are going well for you, honey. And they don't like that. Oh, well. <laughs> we got the tip, the empress. So this can be you, Virgo, or this can be someone that you know that's very loving, kind, hearted, and nurturing. They love unconditionally. And, you know, and they love to help people. Okay, this could be you, or this could be an auntie, a family member, a friend, or who, or this could be your mother, someone that you know that's very loving, kind hearted. Okay, and understanding they've been there and done that, they done been through some shit. Now they done here, they can teach others. Like I said, Ace of Pentacles, Virgo, money is on the way, honey. Money looks good, like I told you, honey. Ace of Wands and all, baby, bad. Yes, you got the star card. This could be Aquarius. You could be you can be getting up with Aquarius. You can be hooking back up with Aquarius. You can be reuniting with Aquarius. It could be an ex or a new person in your life or whatsoever. Okay, but we got this cancer for cups. They mad at you because you don't want the ass no more, Virgo. Mm -mm. Six of Wands. I mean, Six of Swords. This is to be you, Virgo. You traveling towards a, uh, Aquarius or you can be traveling, moving away to Kamawana. Come of water, you get away from these motherfucking people, you just move into a new resident, a new state, a new country, whatsoever. Knight of Wands. It could be someone's coming in toward you. They explain themselves to you, Virgo. Eight of Cups. This is someone's on some bullshit. So this person that Knight of Wands is coming to you, they still look on some bullshit. They still playing mind games with you. They still full of bullshit. Okay. So Virgo, this is y'all reading. I love it, honeys. I love it. Did I say the bottom cards? Hmm. Okay, Virgos. Also, yeah, I didn't... Did I say the bottom cards? I didn't say all of them, but you do have a tower. Okay, this could be a Scorpio. This could be you. Like, secrets and lies also coming out, Virgo, about something you did or what someone said or did to you. So whatever, whoever do in the dark will come out in the light. So be careful drinking and driving, DUI, car accidents. Be careful with fire, candles, stoves, check your smoke detectors, okay? Um, like I said, whatever, whoever doing whatsoever is going to be exposed. Lies, secrets. So I hope it ain't you, Virgo. So like I said, the high priest is spirits that listen to your intuition. Or this is a Pisces around you that's very intuitive. Okay, so spirits that listen to your intuition about someone or something. Ten of Wands, Ten of Swords. This is going to be a Gemini air sign. Someone's feel backstabbed, betrayed by you, Virgo. Or this is you feeling betrayed and hurt about what you heard, about what, what was said. Or this can be a Gemini feeling betrayed by you, hurt by you, Virgo. Okay, we got the hangman. Like I said, someone's trying to put shit on hold as well for you. This could be the past and also this could be the present that's coming back in, okay? All right. Also, be careful too, Virgo. If you come down with some sickness and illness, you need to relax, you need to meditate, you need to get more rest, more sleep. Okay, you need to pray. Be careful. Also, it can be deaf in the family. Someone passing away or whatsoever. But these are the bottom of the cards, okay? All right, Virgo. But far as well, you got a good-ass reading, Virgo. I mean, everything looks beautiful, okay? Your blessings is being heard. Your divine wish is being granted. All right, Virgo. Smooches.